Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Fairgrounds TV. I'm your host, Peter Muller of Fairgrounds Wine and Spirits in lovely Danbury, Connecticut. And uh, I just opened this bottle inside, and I figured, hey, this would be a great beer to do a beer tasting for. This is Victory Brewing's Dark Intrigue. What it is, it is the Storm King Stout aged in Jim Beam and Heaven Hill barrels. And then what they do is they take that liquid and they combine them all together, and then they bottle up, and here you have Dark Intrigue at 9.1%, 9.2% ABV, and uh, let's check it out. I poured it, you can see, I've got this huge, thick, great lacing head. It looks like, kind of like chocolate milk, but uh, let's give it a sniff. Ooh, little on the shiz. Wow, you can get a slight whiskey, charred smell in the nose. Definitely a bunch of toffee and a little bit of mocha. Let's give it a taste. Very thick, smooth on smooth on the tongue, creamy. Tons of toffee coming out, tons. Um, it's definitely coming from the oak and the and the bourbon, you know, kind of together. Um, wow. I'm usually not an imperial stout fan, but this is fantastic. This is one of the better bourbon barrel aged beers that I've had. Um, there's only one very slight, slight little problem. It's giving me a little bit of hops on the back of the tongue after my second sip, and I'm not a huge fan of that. But this is a good beer. I will drink the rest of this. Um, the other sad note to this is that uh, this is their second time uh, doing this, and it's probably going to be their last. They announced that when it came out, and this is probably the second last time we're going to see this. So very limited supply at the store. I think we got two cases on Friday last week, and we only sold three bottles. So that leaves 21 bottles floating around the store still. So uh, come check it out. Give me some ideas about what other beers you would like to hear about or have me taste and you can check them out. You know, write them up. Uh, give me a little comment at the bottom. Shoot us an email. Uh, and that's about it. And uh, we'll see you this coming Wednesday for another Wine Wednesday. And uh, cheers.